and welcome back to Let's Play Harvest Moon Hero of Leak Valley. Alright, let's get to work. So let me see, I think it's been about a few days since uh, Dia planted those seeds. Maybe we'll go check in or not. Hi, Gwen. Uh, okay. So I guess we're gonna race Gwen instead. I was hoping that Dia would stop by and tell us, and basically give us an update about the seeds she planted, but nope. We're just gonna do a quick horse race. Okay, pretty sure this is also optional. Also, I did remember to put the roots in my inventory, so let's use those real quick, shall we? Alright, let's beat Gwen. I really hope we can beat Gwen. Man, why does she get the star on the inside? Anyways, I'm not sure what type of race this is. I think it might be short distance. I'm not, actually, no, it might be a long distance race. I think they're both long distance racers. Yeah, this is definitely long distance. It's been way too short for a short distance. Or it's too long for a short distance race. Okay, I'm okay with this. I have roots, so we should be fine. Yeah, it's a good thing I remembered to put those in my inventory. Just in case something like this would happen. But yeah, I'm pretty sure these are all still optional events you don't need for the horse race ending. I'm just like, gonna eat that root real quick. There we go. But yeah, I'm pretty sure we don't need either of these events for the horse race ending. I might want to make sure I save some roots for the horse race though. Well then again, no, I want fast items for the horse race. Because I think next time we're going to try doing the short distance one. Because we've already won the long distance one and the hurdles I am, or sorry, steeplechase, I'm just not good at at all. Oh god, don't you dare. No, come on. Just a little bit more. I believe in you. I believe in you. Oh my god, that was really, really, really close. We literally ran out of stamina as we were crossing the finish line. Yep, we won, Gwen. Pay me. But yep, we are definitely doing the qualifying race. It's the very first race of spring, so we have plenty of time still. We'll have to make sure we keep training with Bob, though. Well, it is Thursday. Do we want to go see if we can train today? I'm still pretty sure that we can't train during the winter, but we could try again today. I don't know why I came back inside. Anyways, uh, we might as well do some work before we go, though. Also, I do have a bunch of crops and milk to sell today, so we'll stop by, like, the cafe later and get those sold off. Maybe we'll check in on Dia tomorrow, then. I mean, yeah, it's been about, what, a couple of days at least since we talked to her last about the seeds. Well, last time we gave her the seeds to plant. So yeah, she should be done with them pretty soon. That is, if she did manage to kill the crops, which, I don't know, she seemed to be doing a pretty good job last time we checked. None of the crops were withered or anything, so yeah, I think she'll be fine. Unless if not, we, she can probably just have Gina do it for her. Gina probably knows how to deal with plants. Or not, who knows. Alright, so crops have been watered. Let's go check on the animals. Oh wait, did I get these last two? Yes, I did. We'll also have to make sure to feed the dog when we come back out. Maybe we'll feed him something good for once. We have been feeding him eggs. Oh, let's give him, like, milk or something. Actually, I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to give dogs milk. Actually, no, I think they're okay with milk. I'm not really sure, actually. Like, we've never- we never gave our dog milk. Then again, we never really gave our dog very much human food in general. Try to avoid that kind of stuff. Alright, let's, uh, I think you're the last cow. Yeah, you're the last cow I need to milk. We need to get the eggs. Man, the eggs are what always take forever. Actually, if we really want to make this quick, we can just do this. Force all the animals inside, grab the eggs, and then let them right back out. Maybe I should just stop collecting eggs after- No, 
Eggs are still useful, especially if I, while I keep giving them away and selling them, I guess. Good for that extra bit of money. All right, everyone can come back out now. Eggs are gone. Also, just how well trained are my animals that they just come in and out with the sound of a bell. It's so much more convenient than the old Harvest Moon games where you basically, where the bell just made them follow you. And it kind of made things slower, I feel like, sometimes. Anyways, uh, what time is it? I think... Yeah, let's just go stop by... Bob's real quick, see if we can train. Pretty sure we can't. And then after that, we'll go to the cafe, I guess. There's nothing else we really need to do at the moment. Right now, we gave Chester all the materials the day before yesterday. And by that, I mean yesterday. So hopefully we'll hear back from him at some point. Oh wait, wrong area. Right, he's over at the uh, pasture. I still don't know what Chester's planning to do with all the ore we gave him, but... I'm sure he knows what he's doing. I hope he knows what he's doing. Yeah, we can't train during the winter. Alright. We'll have to come back once spring gets here. So we'll have another couple of training sessions before the big race. I really hope we can win this, because if I don't, I'm screwed. But I'm pretty sure we can do it. It's not too hard. Even though it's called the qualifying race, it's no harder than any of the other races. We just have to make sure we don't do steeplechase, because I'm bad at it. Anyways, let's go see how the, uh, whatever she planted or doing. We never really find out what, or we never really found out what kind of crops they were. Okay, but yeah, looks like we'll have a couple, another couple of days before they're ready. Alright. But yeah, once they're fully grown, she'll come tell us. So I guess, yeah, we do have another few days to go. What if I just cut? No. Uh, I don't know if this would be... Ho no, 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 no. Do not do that. Do not ruin Dia's hard work. Hi, speaking of Dia, hi Dia. Oh god, I'm pretty sure you can't cut the crops with your sickle, but I'm not gonna risk it. Dia would absolutely kill me if I did that to her. Uh, let's just do a bit of fishing. Oh wait, do I have bait? I do have bait. Oh wait, no. I think I've done ocean fishing already. Let's go to the uh, lake then. Do some fishing over there. And then we'll come back later and give all the fish to Ponta. I think we've done ocean fishing in the winter. I mean, we have plenty of winter left. We can just come back later if we need to. Oh wait, Thursday. I was gonna say, we could also cut down some wood, but nope. Forgot Thursday. We could also go mining, but meh. I'm over mining at the moment. We've done a lot of ore stuff recently, so... Actually, no, we have burned through a lot of ore. Eh, let's just go see, uh, what's his face? Rudolph. See what he's up to. Hi, buddy. Here, you want a golden egg? It's shiny. He likes it. He just doesn't want to admit it. Whoops. Alright, so Alice should be in her office now. So let's go see her real quick. I do want to check her heart level next time I'm at home. I'm pretty sure we're at, like, one or two at this point. Probably still one. Hi, Alice. That's a sickle. That That's not for you. This is for you. I'm still worried about the fact that she is basically telling us that she's going to build another robot. Like, apparently that last robot hit you your, your finances so hard that you had to delay your giant cake contest. Why are you running a cake contest anyways? What does Funland actually do? I'm guessing just entertainment in general, so... I don't know, maybe it's like a giant reality TV show with the whole cake thing. That would be kind of cool. Alright, what do I have that the Harvest Goddess might like? 
Uh, berry berries? I have a ton of berry berries. I want to get along with girls better. There we go. Alright, let's go do a, bit of, do a bit of fishing then. Then we'll stop by the cafe, get a few things sold off, uh, go see Ponta, and then we'll call it a day. Oh, also, while I'm here... Uh, let's see. Do you like eggs? I like eggs. Do you like eggs? Everyone likes eggs. Did she just do a spin? Hi, Parson. Do you know anything about that cherry tree yet? Yet? Nope. I don't know where this conversation came from, but okay. Let's just go fishing, shall we? Actually, while I'm here, you want an octopus? I have a spare. I do want to befriend Joe at some point. I want to befriend everyone at some point. Except Charles. No one likes Charles. He's a jerk. And doesn't deserve my friendship or my eggs. Alright, what do we got here? We got ourselves a greenling. Yeah, I don't think we've done uh, lake fishing yet during the winter. So I think we're going to be getting a lot of new fish for Ponta. I don't even remember what else we unlock via Fish Prince. What is that? That is a smelt. Have we caught a smelt before? I feel like we have. We might not have though. I don't remember having a smelt. I feel like a Fish print for a smelt will be really hard to see actually. Bite down. Bite down. Bite down. Okay, fine. Don't bite down. I was kind of hoping that would work. Fine, we'll try for this fish instead. Ooh, okay, yeah, that's not deep enough. Try again. We'll keep going until, like, around four. That is definitely deep enough for someone to take notice of. Someone bite down. Thank you. Oh, that was the fish we were trying for, for the uh, first time. It was a smelt. Great. I'll take it. Let's see what the shallow fish is over here. There we go. What are you? Please be something good. You're another... Oh my god, why are there so many of these? Why are they all in different depths? Are smelt even freshwater fish? I think they're freshwater fish. Uh, you look like a mountain grunt. I've caught plenty of mountain grunts. I think that's deep enough. Yep, it was deep enough. Uh, another mountain grunt. I'll take it. Let's catch this last fish and then go. Please don't be another smelt. I have a lot of smelt already. It's another one. Great. Okay, yeah, we're not... Oh, it's a surf smelt. Still, we're done here. Hi, Chester. So what'd you do with all that ore I gave you? Some of that ore was really, really rare. Let's not spend the next eight hours with you. Alright, but yeah, let's stop by the cafe for a bit and then we'll go see uh, Ponta. Also, Katie, how's that cake going? I see. Haven't really worked on it, have you? Oh, wait. Uh, before we sell anything, let me just make sure of one thing. It's just... Yeah, it's just mineral tomatoes. Okay. I can't turn into any of these, right? Not really. Nope. Eh, might as well grab them. Alright, then we can just safely sell these then. All my milk, all my gold milk, and uh, I'll keep the eggs for now. We're up to 12,000 gold. 
All right, so let's go see Ponta and then we'll call it a day. I don't think there's anything else I'm forget. I don't think there's anything else I'm forgetting to do today. No, I'm pretty sure we're good. We also haven't really been to the grocery store for a while. We should probably go check in on them for uh, at some point. Yeah, I'm sure they're fine, but we should probably stop by there just to make sure that we're not missing an event or anything. There he is. Oh, hey, there's Tim. Hey, buddy. Anything new? That's not a bug, that's a crab, but okay. Also, bugs don't really come out during the winter. Alright, buddy, here we go. Let's get started. So, a greenling. Have I caught a greenling before? Yes, I have. I learned how to make miso greenling. Great. Eel, I know I've caught before. Smelt. Have I caught one of these before? Nope. Fish print, please. Huh. That's bigger than I thought it would be. I thought it would just be a dot. Alright, so Mountain Grunt I know I've caught before. Surf Smelt? Have we caught a Surf Smelt before? Yes, we have. Fish and Herbs. Is that like Fish and Chips? And I've definitely caught Mountain Grunt before, right? Yep. We learned how to make fried mushrooms. Okay, got some new recipes. Let's just head home and go to bed. Also, Hanks, apparently- I'll Wait, yeah, I forgot to feed my dog. Whoops. I should probably feed my dog. It's gonna be sunny tomorrow. Great. That's probably why I can't get to three hearts with the dog. I keep forgetting sometimes. Okay, yeah, we have another few days before Dia's ready with the crops. Hi, doggy. You're a good dog. Everyone loves my dog. Yeah, let's just make sure we feed you. Uh, have an egg. Alright, so the mineral tomatoes are... Are they done? No, not yet. We have another few days, I think. Maybe another day or two, actually, looking at it. So once that's done, we can turn those in for a nice payday. Tomatoes are growing nicely. Breadfruit is growing... Oh my god, I just realized there's how many tomatoes I planted. Wait. This is breadfruit, not a... Uh... It's breadfruit, not tomatoes. Duh. For some reason, I said tomatoes. I was looking at this one. And then I remembered this is the one that I'm not doing because we don't have enough time for it. Okay. But the breadfruit is almost done growing. God, I have a lot of breadfruit. I might have planted too much breadfruit. Whoops. We'll just make sure we get everything watered. Yeah, maybe we'll also stop by Woody's later. I, I really should be grinding wood. But it takes so long and I don't need wood for anything anymore. Maybe. We might stop by Woody's later. But yeah, another day or two and all the breadfruit should be done. And we're gonna have a ton of it to sell. Oh my god. Yeah, I'm starting to regret planting this much breadfruit. I just don't have... I like variety in my fields. Also, I'm pretty sure in real life you're supposed to rotate crops anyways. Just so that, uh... The soil doesn't, like, die on you from, like trying to use one crop over and over and over again, and just draining all the nutrients out of the soil. Then again, I think this is just a magic field anyway, so it doesn't matter. We don't ever have to fertilize or worry about anything. Alright, let's go take care of the other animals. I think I might have to let the uh, horse out. No, horse is outside, never mind. Still gonna do this though, just so I can grab my eggs. But other than that, there's nothing else I really need to do today. Dia seems to be doing fine with her crops. Parsley has kind of just started ignoring us in terms of that cherry tree. Uh, what else are we doing? Oh, everyone can come back outside now. Katie's working on the cake. Chester is doing who knows what with all that ore we gave him. He might have eaten it. I'm not really sure. I really hope he didn't eat it, because uh, Ori Calcum's kind of rare, but whatever. He can do whatever he wants with it. As long as it saves the valley somehow. Oh, 
Also, I really wish we could just go into the ocean at some point. Why is it that I never introduce swimming in these games? I don't see if there would... Actually, no, I guess there are some games where you could go into the water, but... What if you could, like, farm underwater? I don't know why that popped into my head. I just saw the ocean and immediately thought of underwater farming, which I'm pretty sure is not a thing. Whatever. Alright, so animals have been taken care of. We got everything. You know what? Why not? Let's go collect some wood today. Wood is useful. Plus, eventually we will want wood just to upgrade, to get a couple more upgrades. We might as well start gathering wood now. Also, is there anything else I need to buy right now? I think we're good on supplies. We have plenty of chicken feed, because I made sure I bought a ton of that. Fodder, we just cut down ourselves. Yeah, I think we're good overall. Hey, Parsley. Anything about that tree yet? No? Okay. Thanks, buddy. Alright, let's just get ourselves some lumber then. We haven't been here for a while, so the trees are probably relatively big. Okay, yeah, we got a big tree. Let's go for that one first. Let's also make sure we have an axe, not a sickle out. Unfortunately, there is a maximum amount. I think there's only, only, only one big, big tree like this one. The rest are usually small to medium. All right, couple more swings and we've got it. There we go. Also, I like how when it's falling, you don't even try to move away. You just plant yourself and watch it fall. Probably super dangerous, but hey, we can't die, apparently. We can't even get sick. Are we a superhero? We might be a superhero. We don't really have a superpower, but our superpower is the ability to grow crops. That's not a superpower, but whatever. Uh, let's just get like one more tree and then we'll get out of here. Ah, uh, four pieces of wood. I'll take it. Maybe we'll also check inside just to make sure that there's nothing new unlocked. Pretty sure there isn't. Also, it's almost noon already. Man, t now that I have so many animals, taking care of them kind of takes a while. Also, doesn't help that my field is a bit bigger than I wanted to be. Maybe we'll start cutting down on field size. No, you know what? No. If I want to do my whole self-imposed challenge of trying to raise as much money before the end of the year of year two as possible, I need to plant more stuff next year. We're not planting more stuff next year, but I'm not cutting back. Yeah, there's nothing else we can do right now. Okay. In that case, I think I'll end the episode here. So, next time on Let's Play Harvest Moon Hero Play Valley, more winter. Winter's already halfway over. Feels like this season went by relatively quickly. Actually, this season... No, actually, I take that back. The season's gone by a bit slower just because it's so dense with, like, story events, but... Hey, it's been interesting. So, till next time.